In this video, we are going to learn how to solve problems involving geometric progression using shortcut tricks fast in seconds. Now, this video will be very useful to you if you are writing board exams like GCSE, A level maths, even if you are a college student or high school student writing algebra exam involving multiple choice questions or uh, geometric sequence. This video will be very useful to you. Okay, let me know that. Let's solve this problem we have here. Okay, so in this question, we have, we have the question says the fifth time of a GP is this and this and the third time is this find common ratio and the first time. So in the question we have the T five to be eighteen. Okay, we have the T three to be two. Okay, I'm looking for common ratio R and the first time A. So the general formula for finding geometric sequence or geometric progression is a r n minus one so for c5 is going to be a r five minus one which is as a r to the power four then t3 will be a r three minus one which is a r to the power two okay so the trick the shortcut trick now you apply will be to get the common ratio will be to divide this higher term with the lower term so it's going to be a out to the power of four equals 18 divided by a out to the power of two equals two so this a we count this a so this out the law of indices if values are dividing each other and the base is the same so try the powers so it's going to be the base is same r and r it's going to be four minus two equals when 18 divide two you're going to have nine all right so we have our square equals nine so make out the subject formula you square both sides right so this square we call the square roots so we're going to have our will be square root of nine which will give us words there is so the common ratio is three now that we have the common ratio to get the first time very, very simple all we have to do a bit to substitute this out in either this or this okay so let's use the third term to do it c3 equals a r square so it's going to be when you put the value of r going to be a three square equals two okay so this is the same thing as nine a equals two so to make a the subject formula the bible side by nine so now you can see each other therefore our a will be two over nine that's the first time so guys this is how you can solve problems involving geometric progression using this shortcut trick hope you learned something interesting this video will be very useful to you writing your board exams like a level maths gcse exam and the rest of them that's it for this live guys thanks for watching if you are new to the channel be sure to hit the subscribe button not to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this so like share and comment on this video then how you achieve and what you learned from this class. If you seem to have any specific questions to ask, feel free to leave your questions in the comment section below. And I'll be sure to give a response. That is for this class, guys. Thanks for watching.